Fungicide season is fast approaching. What are you doing to make sure that your fungicide investment is giving you the highest rate of return? My name is Tyler Steinkamp, agronomist for Winfield United. And today we're going to focus in on how to choose the fields that will provide you the best rate of return for your fungicide investment and what adjuvants need to go into the tank to make sure that we're getting the product out of the sprayer into the crop. When choosing which fields to apply a fungicide to in corn, the first thing that I look at is previous crop. If we planted corn on corn, I generally recommend doing a fungicide application. If, however, you planted corn on soybeans, I then look at what is the response to fungicide of the particular hybrid. And if you want to know the response to fungicide on the particular hybrid you planted, contact your local Winfield United retail. For soybeans, I look at general yield potential and overall disease potential to determine which fields I'm going to apply a fungicide to. The next thing that we have to look at is what type of adjuvants we need to use with the application. Coverage is extremely important in a fungicide application. I always recommend having a drift and deposition product like Masterlock in the tank to get better canopy penetration. This demonstration done with red dye shows the importance of having a drift and deposition aid in the tank. As you can see, the tank that had the master lock in it got better canopy penetration and better coverage on this sheet of paper. Choosing the right fields and having the proper adjuvant in the tank can help you increase your return on investment for a fungicide application. For more information, contact your local Winfield United retailer or click the link below.